peeps what's up how's it going it's josh jesus god there's already stuff going on all right huh i hope you guys are doing well today is kind of a special day um we're going to try kind of an experiment not that i'm totally expecting anything to actually happen but it might and i think it'd be kind of cool so today as i record this it is april 8th 2024 which means it's a solar eclipse day and so gearing up here the solar eclipse is going to be starting really i mean kind of like in the next 10 minutes or so so i'm not obviously watching the eclipse at all um i'm placing myself inside of malvern manor and we're going to try all sorts of fun crap so with that let me show you kind of what I have here, if I can get some light on the situation here. So we have, obviously we're going to be using this, the Spirit Portal device. We are going, I mean, I have a, a K2 meter that I have over here kind of positioned right there. Perfecto. Also, guys, notice I have got these doors closed i've closed the doors um not for any reason in particular but i didn't want any excess light coming through the door um and all of that crap so we do have some light that is kind of pouring through here then of course down here guys i already have this up and going this is our tracer wire, just to make sure, so we can track movement or whatever, if anything does decide to cruise by. But also have these fun little cat balls, just because I'm a sucker for these cat balls. So for whatever reason, I absolutely enjoy the crap out of them. I'm going to do a quick little switch here, a little white balance on the camera okay so cat balls are going and calibrating they should shut off momentarily I'm like any minute now <laughs> there you go all right so there we have that like i said our k2 meter chilling out Doing its thing. All right. So earlier, guys, before, like when I was just talking to the camera, I was hearing something over here. And I'd like to know if that was you. Shut the door, man. Hey. Shut the door. What the hell was that? Hello? That was certainly like knocking. So I'm going to go ahead and see if that was in any one of these rooms. Open up. Okay. Was somebody knocking out here? Or in one of these rooms?
do another quick white balance. Everything is so weird. So guys, I thought it would be super cool if we could check out anything that was going on, like, um, I guess I'm trying to find the right words. Atmospherically, if anything weird was going on, right? So atmospherically with the solar eclipse and all of that stuff, like if there was anything that was interesting about it, especially from like a paranormal aspect, like yeah, I, am, I am fascinated. All right, well, Rebecca, white balance again. There we are. Just trying to walk you through what I'm doing with the camera, guys, as I'm doing it. Like moving in and out of rooms with natural light and things like that and then going into a dark hallway really kind of messes with things sometimes. So I'm trying to just kind of stay on top of it. Well, let's see. this back up all right guys it's just us now it's just us here in the hallway do you know what is happening right now you've got to be sure I don't know if you're hearing it, guys. There's a knock. Hello? It's, it's, so, it's not even a knock. It's more of a tap. It could be anything. Like, I'm not suggesting it's paranormal. But, I mean, it could be anything. There's a truck passing outside right now. So, I guess let's see here. Turn this on. Hey. Hello. Hello. Sup. <laughs> Sup. I always find it so interesting when, when spirits speak like I speak. Sup? <laughs> What's up, dude? If you guys are like fans of the TV show Friends or whatever, you could be like, Sup with the whack PlayStation? What's up? Do you know what today is? No? Do you guys, are you guys going to watch the solar eclipse? Did you know that there's a solar eclipse? Right now. Right. <laughs> Very interesting, though. Hello. I think it might be too loud, maybe. Like, maybe, maybe it is too loud. I'm not sure. What? 
Whoa, movement. Hello. Who is that, please? Was somebody, was somebody knocking on stuff? Gee, burrs. Hey, do you want to come and say hello? Hi, are you having a good day today? Try to clear this up a little bit, guys. I'm not sure, not sure if I'll be able to. I'm trying. That will help a little bit, huh? Okay. What did you just say? Yeah, what was that? Did somebody just say he's coming? Yeah, who's he? What the? Yeah, who's coming? Huh? He sees you. All right. Well, honestly, guys, I mean, so far we have literally nothing on the K2 meter that I've noticed. I mean, nothing has hit on that. We, nothing has hit as far as the cap balls, as far as the tracer wire, none of it. Nothing has gone on yet. Now, there have been knocks. <laughs> I swear it just said good talk. Good talk, bro. Yeah. Guys, guys are you going to watch the solar eclipse? It's kind of a big deal. Kind of. What's interesting is that there are numerous people out there that would tell you that this is the, the ushering in of the end of the world, which I think is complete crap, if we're being honest. You too? Good. Another little knock. More of a tap. Can you do that again? Can you tap? I 
I tell you what, it is so difficult filming in this hallway just because it's such a long hallway, but you have things on literally either side of you, so it's like you kind of have to keep your head on a swivel, I suppose. Yeah. Make sure that the cat ball still works. You good? What is your name? Who am I speaking to? Eddie? Eddie's voice has been coming through quite a bit. If you see this right here, guys. It's Eddie. Eddie, are you uh are you coming just to say hello? Yeah? Is Eddie still around? <laughs> Not really? That is a big truck outside. That scared me a smidge. Whoa! Whoa! Guys, we're gonna have to pull that out. Um, one second here. So, as I'm standing here, I said, I said the words like, that scared me a little. Because there was a big truck outside and it was like boom, 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 boom on the road. You could hear that. And I said, that scared me a little. And I'm not even lying when I heard a very audible, <laughs> like a laugh. But it, directly beside me. And I mean like right in this little layer of space here. Like, like a... <laughs> Were you laughing at me? That's pretty trippy. But basically guys, the idea is to see if anything, any weird changes like atmospherically that are going on with this, uh, with this eclipse, could potentially uh, like help or hinder paranormal experiences. And so far, so far we got next to nothing. But it's pretty cool, regardless. All right. I'm trying to kind of keep my distance from this. Like if I step too close, I'll kind of cause a, a false positive here and I, I certainly don't want to do that. So I'm trying to kind of stay away from the device without, without tripping it. All right, position myself all the way down the hall here so I can see I have a pretty good shot now of the entire hallway, including even the, the stuff in front of me. 
There are three cap balls. There's this really cool tracer wire. There's a K2 meter all the way down the hall as well. And I'm sitting down. Is there a way that you could knock on a door or even open a door? Could you open one of the doors that I have closed? It is very, very quiet back here today. I think very, very quiet back here today. Okay. Turn this guy back on. What do you need? What about Rebecca? Is she around today? Rebecca, are you here? Rebecca, could you maybe open your door for me real quick? No? You don't have to. I tell you what, could you open your door when you're ready for, when you're ready for company? I'd like to come in and say hello, if I could, please. Very interesting indeed. Yeah. Again, like nothing really seems to be to be going on. We are getting some interesting voices. Some interesting responses. Who needs help? <coughs> Excuse me. Who needs help? I heard I heard a female say I need help. knock right here. All right. Cool. <laughs> Hello. Who was that, please? So guys, just so you know, like... I heard a knock coming from down the hall, maybe halfway down that hallway. And then immediately after, a knock right here against this wall, right close to that fire extinguisher.
Were you trying to get my attention? Oh. Oh. All right. So there were three knocks down here. Use my foot to open the door there, guys. Door behind me. Guys, who was knocking? What the frick? You just knocked through the spirit box too? It went boom, boom. Yeah, super cute. Well, I mean, you have my attention. You might as well tell me what you need. Nothing on the K2. Just sitting there. Rebecca, can you open your door? Can I come inside, please? Okay. She said, uh huh. And then, no. <laughs> Rebecca, if you, if you would open your door, I could come in and say hello. Could you do it? That's a truck outside. <gasps> no fucking way. No fucking way. Yep, no, thank you, Rebecca, thank you. Oh my God, guys, it did it again. We caught it again. This is the second time I believe we've captured this. Oh my gosh. Thank you, Rebecca. Can I, can I come in now, please? Oh my God, that was great. Thank you so much. For, for opening your door. Can I come in just for a couple minutes? Somebody is not happy. Somebody is not happy. Who's upset? Well, I'm going to walk inside of Rebecca's room briefly. Okay? Oh my God. Guys, how the hell that happened was absolutely phenomenal.
absolutely phenomenal. That was super cool. Rebecca, I hope you're having a great day. Thank you for opening your door. That was amazing. I'm just going to leave it open if that's okay with you. I'll leave your door open, okay? Thank you so much. That was insane, guys. That was absolutely insane. I cannot believe we captured that again. I am so flipping jazzed right now. I don't give a shit if anything else happens. That was worth it. Holy shit, that was worth it. Like, that happened right as we were standing at her flipping door. We asked for it to happen, and it happened. Oh my God. Rebecca, you're the best. So again, guys, whether or not, whether or not anything, like as far as like the solar activity, the atmospheric activity right now, as far as that is concerned, like does it or doesn't it affect the, the paranormal experience here, right? The hell was that? Yeah, chill out, please. Yikes, guys. And for us to be standing, like, specifically where I was standing was right here. Like, right here. I mean, against, not even the door frame, this wall. Standing here. <sighs> Holy shit, that was awesome. Sounded like a child. Jesus. All right. That was freaking cool. Pretty good day, I would say. Pretty good session, I would say. I should have just put all this stuff down there because apparently that's where all the action is. My God. Like, not a lot has happened here at all. So... Hear birds chirping outside. What? (laughs) 
Super cool day. Super cool day. Hate this room so much. All right, guys. Well, thank you very much for your time. I guess I'll just leave you all alone, if that's all right. My God. <laughs> I'm not even, I don't even know what they're trying to say. Don't even know what they're trying to say right now. All I do know is that that freaking door back there opened. That freaking door opened. Seemingly on command, right? Like it opened. You heard it. You could hear the damn knob jiggle. So I hope that we captured all of that, especially like audio wise. I hope that my lav mic that I have on right here, I hope it picked up that, like the clicks and the, all of that. Like that was phenomenal. Um, guys, I... <laughs> This is really cool. I wanted to do this just, just thinking to myself, how cool would it be if something actually were to happen? Something significant were to happen. And I have no idea what all we captured. I have no idea if even like a cat ball or anything like that down the hallway went off because I certainly didn't see it. Um, but man, guys, this was fun. This was a lot of fun. I hope you enjoyed it. Not a lot. There were significant things that happened. Nothing like completely earth shattering, nothing crazy. Um, but things to probably write home about, I would say, right? So interesting things nonetheless. Um, guys, I hope you can hear me, but thank you for your time. I appreciate it. You make a cat ball go off for me? No. Whatever. Guys, thank you specifically for everything. The, the likes and the shares and the, the comments and all that stuff, guys. I appreciate it. Um, I hope all of you are doing well. And I hope you're all um, healthy and, and safe and all of that fun jazz too. But guys... Thank you very much. I'm going to start picking up all of this equipment. I'm going to get the hell out of here, all right? But I hope you're doing well, and we'll talk to you all soon. Peace.